Ness, uh, what do you think about the game uh, so far? We, we played hard. I mean, uh, we killed off a five-minute major penalty. Unfortunately, we uh, allowed a shorthand a goal right after that. Uh, we were pressing, and we wanted, to, we wanted to tie the game, and so that happens sometimes. But I'm very proud of them. They fought to the very end, and this is what it's going to take for us to be competitor in the league and to be taken seriously, and we're going to keep fighting to the end. What do you think? Uh, you win uh, for zero against uh, Alexander yesterday, and uh, now uh, it's uh, losing. What do you think about the uh, up and down for your teams? It's it's been one of those battles for us. Uh, we're playing 500 hockey. Uh, I mean, before the, this loss, we were four and one. You know, at the last five, so we got a lot of good things going, and that's what we gotta we just stay with is the good stuff and the po keep it positive because that's what's going to drive us forward going to the end. Uh, it's your second uh, year uh, for SDE. Uh, what do you think about this year or uh, last year? I mean, uh, it's a big difference this year. Uh, we've we've really tried to build a brand here and change the program quite a bit, and we've done that. So it's one of those things that uh, last year uh, we were competitive. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't get the wins, uh, but we started to being competitive there. And this year, it's a big change from not just being competitive, but expecting the win. And that locker room expects the win. And so a loss like this, uh, we feel it. And so we're going to come out hard uh, for next weekend and, and prove that that we belong here and, and that we always have belonged here. Your goalkeeper uh, post and uh, Ray Deborn has been a good uh, season this year. What do you think about that? I I love it. I mean, and it was one thing that we said that we needed to have was uh, two outstanding goaltenders, and we have two outstanding goaltenders. Uh, we are not afraid to put either one in the net, and we can play a strong hockey game with both of them. So having two great goaltenders like that makes it a very strong uh, uh, season for us. Do you get headache for uh, which uh, goalkeeper you get for the next um, match? It definitely doesn't make it easy, you know. Uh, uh, that's the hard thing because you know you're going to disappoint one of them uh, because they both want to play. And that's what we like, though, is they're both competitors. Uh, but they also the other thing is, is when one's in the net, the other one's rooting for them. So b that being said, it's, it's great to have that in-house competition, but it's a friendly competition where they both go. So it's, uh, it is tough to decide each night uh, who's going for who. What do you th take uh, with you with the, this game? Uh, we just got to we got ourselves into some penalty trouble uh, as far as uh, pl always playing shorthanded, which means we get out of our rhythm of rolling three lines. Uh, when we roll three lines and keep them short, that's when we're at our best. And so tonight we uh, kind of had some trouble with that, especially with the major penalty. Uh, took five minutes of us uh, just rolling pretty much five six players, and that kind of gets everybody out of the rhythm, and then. You have to come back into it, which is part of the game, but uh, that that hurt us a bit tonight. Uh, I know uh, the head coach uh, not to uh, talk about uh, the referees uh, uh, about the game, but you have uh, been a referee uh, uh, earlier, so what do you think about this game or referee? You know, the job's never easy. You know, uh, of course, I would like more calls for us uh, and less calls for them, but uh, it's part of the game, and she sees the game for tonight. Uh, she saw the game the way she saw it, and there's nothing we can do about that. We just got to worry about playing our game and and not worrying about what the officials are doing, and that's a that's a learning process for everybody. Um, so, you know, tonight, of course, would I like more power plays? Of course, uh, but uh, it didn't happen, and uh, we got to just move on, move forward on that. Next game here in in Bay Sisal, it's uh, against uh, Hovi Khotiet. What do you think about that? Uh, it's going to be a tough hockey game. Uh, you know, Hovi is a very strong, competitive team, and uh, we have to come out like we did the first two periods. I, I mean, like tonight, we played a great hockey game overall. We just got a couple of bad bounces, but uh, we got to be able to, to eliminate those bad bounces against a team like Hovi as well uh, to even give us ourselves a chance to... Uh, to win and so that's what we're going to do it's we're going to focus on that uh, for the week and come out strong uh, for saturday night what are you tra uh, training about i'm sorry uh, what do you train uh, for against ahovia oh it's more or less about moving the puck uh, uh not getting caught in our zone having strong defensive coverage but getting the puck out when we can and then also making sure we have a strong forward check not giving them the time and space to create the uh offense that they usually create when you give them that time good luck thank you very much